This was a very uh, long and uh, well thought out decision on the part of our health care organization and our facility. Uh, we have seen uh, that through the years the uh, number of patients that we see here that are uh, committed or coming in on an uh, involuntary basis has increased. We also recognize that we are having more and more difficulty serving the people in the five county area here in Brainerd. Uh, and um, we have also seen the amount of violence uh, that occurs in our inpatient setting, both in the inpatient mental health units as well as the medical units increase and the uh, severity of those mental illnesses also uh, increasing along with dual diagnosis of chemical dependency oftentimes. Uh, we made the decision to move from involuntary to voluntary based on the fact that we were struggling to find uh, the staff that was necessary to run the facility. Uh, we had gone four years without a qualified psych uh, psychiatrist candidate um, who was willing to come here. Uh, we have staffed with, uh, fortunately, uh, a very long-term um, mental health provider uh, and uh, another family medicine physician who has, does full-time psychiatry along with uh, very dedicated nurse practitioners that are psychiatric nurse practitioners. But even then, we have struggled to maintain uh, that, um, those professionals to, to keep our facility open. Um, most people who are in that profession uh, tend to uh, not want to come to a small community hospital where they have to take call, but they have to work in an involuntary unit that um, don't have the collaborative and healing relationship that they desire with their patients. And um, we are fortunate to have the staff that we have, uh, but um, it has became quite um, evident that we would be not able to even have a unit if we couldn't staff a unit. That was one of the rationale. Obviously, the importance of keeping our other patients safe, but uh, as well the importance of keeping our staff safe was part of that decision. And then um, more importantly, I think, is that we wanted to make sure that we had access to those patients within our five county area to be able to meet the needs of those people who have severe mental illness as well.